Garvin's Eight Dimensions of Quality David A. Garvin, a Harvard Business School professor and a thought leader in the area of organizational learning, emphasized the importance of understanding quality and its various dimensions. In his 1987 research article published in HBR titled, Competing on the Eight Dimensions of Quality, he highlighted the importance of quality for managers. Garvin noted that it was not until competition from the Japanese and European firms intensified that the U.S.-based companies started focusing on quality seriously. According to him, the business managers needed to adopt a new way of thinking for strategic quality management, which was to understand how customers looked at things or a conceptual bridge to the consumer's vantage point. Managers also needed to see quality as a business strategy and break it into understandable and manageable parts. Only then could they define the quality niches in which to compete. Here are the eight dimensions of quality. Performance is one of the leading dimensions of quality and most customers judge the product's quality based upon performance. For example, if you want a television set, you will be looking for sound, picture clarity, colors, etc. This is what performance means in the case of a television set. Features are the second dimension of quality and often regarded as the second aspect of performance. Features are the characteristics supporting the basic performance of a product or service. For example, by adding free drinks flight services providers improve the appeal of their services. Reliability This dimension of quality is also related to the functioning of the product and how likely it is to fail or malfunction during a specific time period. Garvin has highlighted three measures of reliability which are The mean time to the first failure The mean time between failures The failure rate per unit time Conformance Conformance means the ability to meet established standards The degree to which the design and operating characteristics of a product meet the established quality standards is called conformance this dimension of quality owes the most to the traditional approaches to quality that the experts like profession Joseph M. Duran pioneered. Durability Durability, another dimension of product quality is a measure of product life. It has both economic and technical dimensions. Technically, you can define durability as the amount of use you get from a product before it. Serviceability the sixth dimension of quality is serviceability which simply implies the ease of service or repair. However, apart from the ease of repair, speed, courtesy, and competence also matter. The consumer's concern is what if the product breaks and how much time will it take to restore the services. The last two dimensions of quality are the most subjective. Aesthetics are a matter of personal judgment and individual preference. How much a customer likes the look, feel, sound, taste or smell of a product is all a matter of individual preference. Perceived Quality Consumers do not always have complete information regarding a product or services attributes. Therefore, they use indirect measures to make a comparison. One cannot directly observe durability but can infer it from the various tangible or intangible aspects of the product. In such a situation, brand name, advertising, and images are critical to building the customer's perception of quality. Visit the link in description to learn more. Please subscribe for more educational videos.